Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Essex Park Middle School's 2015 rendition of Employees Must Watch Hands Before Murder and the Night Before the Great Times of All Time. At this time, we ask that you please completely power off any and all electronic devices, including your cell phones, and remind you that flash photography is not permitted. Thank you, and on behalf of Essex Park Middle School, Mrs. Greenway's drama class, and all involved with the production, we hope you enjoy the performance. Who is that? 
I don't know, Sony switched a couple months ago. Mine is Steve. I'm also known as the Fry Master. Why? <laughs> because I'm the Master of Fries. Yes, that makes sense. And this here is Celia, my right hand man. I'm a woman. You are what I say you are. Now get back to work. Whatever. Whatever what? Whatever, my Master. That's better. Now, what you say? Master. All right. From now on, actually, you're going to be known as Brad. All right, Brad? But my name is Ashley. You know, one word, two syllables, Ash, Lee. First thing you got to understand, Brad, that this is my domain. I am king here. What I say becomes law, and I say it becomes Brad. Now, this here is your area. Your area is small because you have no importance. Your job is to dump the fries into the grease. Dump the fries into the grease. Sweet. 
We are in for extreme employment. Rick Jordan is not responsible for pre-existing conditions or conditions which exist at some point in the future. If somebody says safety hazard, they better not, or they could be fired or sued. But I think it's time for a visit from a little friend of mine who various marketing studies have shown to people who appeals to people with limited intellect. Here it is, squirming the musical tapeworm.
fire to clean him up. Whatever. You don't think I'll do something? What are you gonna do? You wanna know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, what are you gonna do? You wanna know? Are you gonna tell me? I'm gonna do something, and that's for sure. It's not the nice, and it's not the new fire, thank you, card, and I'm done. And it might involve fry grease, and it might involve fry grease stuffed on somebody's head, which will give me seconds to be burnt on their face. And then some more stuff I haven't even begun to think of, which is pretty nasty and probably not.
change your mind. <laughs> and maybe he could bring us all his friends, Mr. Roosevelt <laughs> and Mr. Washington again. If I was, would it work? Bribery! One to merit!
you're smart, don't you come in here with all your badges and interns? Straight up! But there's one thing that's gone. Oh, what's that? My defense attorney!
exercise and helping young people like yourself maximize your potential by showing you how trivial and undramatic your relationships and the subject of really are. Hey, it wasn't needless. I loved him. Oh, nonsense. You've only been dating for three months. So? Why can't I know that I love someone in three months? You can't. That's idiotic. You know what Juliet was saying to throw me out of the chicken. I know nothing about you. I'm kind of short. Yeah, I can't be a factor not for Moving on. Katie, I'm here to help you. And after the next 25 minutes, you'll realize that in the scheme of things, your breakup really wasn't all that bad. Because I'm about to show you the 13 worst breakups of all time.
just joking. Well, at least you're finally giving me some space. For a while then, I wasn't even sure you knew how to read <laughs> Elijah. P.S. I know there's a war going on. I fight in it every day. You're no longer bold. Thank you. Elijah Hunt Rose. Dear Elijah, you are ignorant and have the emotional capacity of an infant. Don't fight me anymore. Jessica, I'm not mistaken. Dear Jessica, I am ignoramus. Those are some big words come from the biggest idiot in the world. Idiot. <laughs>
dancing, and now this wall. I'm glad you thought so. I wanted everything about this night to be perfect. It is. It really is. Tyler, what's, what's wrong? You're shaking. I, I'm just nervous. It's just I plan this night out over and over again in my head, and now it's actually here. What? Tyler, what? Julie, from the first moment I laid eyes on you, I knew you were something special. You were so beautiful, and I was so amazed that you would even talk to me. And then over the next year, we got to we really got to know each other. Clearly, you turned out to be very different people. I'm a morning person, you're a night owl. I like sports, you prefer the theater. These past few months we've been so busy, it's like we don't even talk. Okay, that's a weird setup. Sorry, I'm just nervous. I guess what I'm trying to say is, Julie, I know that I may not be the most decisive person at times, but this time I am beyond certain. Will you? No longer be my girlfriend? Yes! Wait, what? Oh, thank God she said yes! Oh, no. I'm so nervous! Stop! Let go of me! What? Did you just break up with me? Yes, I did! A thousand times yes! Shut up! What is wrong with you? What do you mean? The romantic dinner? Making us get all dressed up? I wanted us to go out on a high note.
what I say And here I am Open arms Hoping you see What your love means to me Open arms Jefferson you're the light on my grave. I love you so much, babe. Happy anniversary.
Hey, Eve, thanks for meeting me after school. No problem, nothing to do with the success. Hopefully, rehearsals are going really well, and the director said he nailed this one night. You know, I have that one night. Oh, I can't wait to see it. I'm going to come Friday's okay. Um, well, that's what I wanted to talk to you about.
go together. I'm sorry, you're really sweet and pretty. You guys got on a three month relationship and it was really messy. Same here, that's perfect. I mean, mine was really bad. It was like the worst no, 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 no. breakup ever. <laughs>